Do you know what happens when electricity flows through a metal wire? Normally, it doesn't care which direction it's going in. It flows just as easily forward as it does backwards. And if you want electricity to flow in a single direction, you need a special electronic part called a diode, which blocks currents in the opposite direction. But scientists have now discovered that weak magnetic fields can reverse tiny electrical currents in Kagome metals. This means that it doesn't require an external device such as a diode to do so, unlocking the secrets of how the flow of electricity is regulated. Hi, my name is Soumya Pillai and in this episode of Pure Science, I will tell you about this unique discovery. Kagome metals naturally prefer electricity to flow in one way and when you apply even a tiny magnetic field, it suddenly flips that preference. The word kagome comes from a traditional Japanese basket weaving pattern made up of interlocking triangles. You will now see an image of the pattern on your screens. Now why has a metal been named after a basket weave you might ask? This is because when you zoom in to see how the atoms of this metal are arranged, you will see the same triangular pattern repeating endlessly which resembles a beautiful geometric web. But this pattern does more than just look pretty. It completely changes how electrons behave inside the metal. In a normal metal, electrons move more or less freely, like marbles rolling through a tube. In Kagome metals though, the triangular arrangement creates what scientists call frustration. The electrons can't move in a straight line because the geometry keeps sending them into loops. As a result, instead of flowing smoothly, electrons start circling around in tiny orbits, what researchers called loop currents. These are like microscopic whirlpools of electricity that form naturally inside the material. And because moving charges create magnetic fields, these loops generate their own mini magnets at atomic level. A few years ago, physicists studying Kagome metals noticed something weird. When they applied a weak magnetic field to one of these materials, the direction of the current flow, the one the metal liked, suddenly reversed. The metal essentially switched its own internal wiring. Even more surprising, the strength of this reversal was about a hundred times stronger than anything traditional theories of magnetism or conductivity could explain. For a while, it was a mystery, but now a team from the Nagoya University in Japan has finally worked out what's going on. Their new theory shows that this strange behavior occurs because of three hidden quantum effects working together. The first are loop currents, which are tiny circular flows of electrons inside the triangles. The second are charge density waves, gentle ripples in how tightly electrons are packed in different regions of the metal. And the third is quantum geometry, a property that comes from the wave-like nature of electrons influenced by the triangular atomic pattern. These three effects combine to make the metal break a basic rule of physics called symmetry. Usually material don't prefer one direction of current over another. Forward and backward should be equal. But when symmetry breaks, that balance disappears. The metals start favoring one direction. Then when an external magnetic field is applied, it flips those internal loop currents. A tiny push at the quantum level ends up reversing the large scale flow of electricity. It's a striking example of how quantum physics can amplify small effects into big, Visible changes like whispering into a microphone and hearing your voice boom through a stadium speaker, if you will. This discovery doesn't just solve a long-standing puzzle, it could also open entirely new ways to control electricity. Imagine magnetic switches that operate without moving parts, memory devices that store information using minimal energy, or sensors that can detect extremely weak magnetic fields by just measuring changes in current direction. Right now though, there are limits. The effects only appear under special conditions. At extremely low temperatures, around minus 190 degrees Celsius, and in very pure samples. 
But now that scientists understand the mechanism behind it, they can start searching for new material where the same physics might appear at higher, more practical temperatures. The work also shows just how rich and surprising quantum material can be. By simply changing how atoms are arranged, in this case, in a pattern of triangles, scientists can unlock entirely new electrical behaviours that don't exist in ordinary metals. At the core, this discovery is a reminder that even familiar things like electricity still hold mysteries. I will be back next week unlocking more such scientific mysteries only on Pure Science with the print.